welcome back to my channel if you're a savvy welcome back homie if you're new here welcome to the channel join the homies club click that subscribe button down below guys welcome to my kitchen reveal video don't worry we're not in the kitchen we're gonna go there in a moment <laughs> if you've been part of the homies club you'll know that my husband and i moved into our first home um about a year and a half ago and usually when people move into their house the first thing that they want to do is to personalize their home um do re renovations and everything and we were no different we were tempted but we afforded ourselves a opportunity to think things through a little bit more to think um if renovations <clears throat> will make financial sense for us and whatever the sort and quite honestly this house was not very bad the only thing that was glaring to us at least to me that bothered me the most is the kitchen the kitchen needed to go <laughs> there was no other option so that's the thing that we decided to just um tackle first in renovating so we're based in cape town right and in the city kitchen renovations are quoted to uh, about 200,000 and more maybe 200,000 150,000 for a small kitchen like ours we have a very small kitchen um but yeah around about that much and then we thought about it and we thought are we willing to spend that much chunk of our savings on something like just a kitchen renovation um in a house that is probably not going to be our forever home you know and we thought not so we thought actually how much can we get the look that we want without spending that much or without hurting our um savings you know um so we thought could we actually achieve what the look that we want to achieve for like a tenth of the usual coat so we set out to do a kitchen renovation for 20,000 rand guys I kid you not <laughs> it sounds unbelievable but we have achieved it um, what I'm going to do I'm going to roll out the process show you guys what the kitchen looked like before um, the process of transforming it from changing the countertops oh by the way we went to vinyl wrapping because the kitchen cupboard was uh, the kitchen cupboards were still in a good condition so we thought instead of replacing them all together we can just vinyl wrap them we did some research and found out that vinyl wrapping is something that can last for five to ten years and we thought for our little budget that sounds good enough um for us because um if we were going to spend two hundred thousand, the thing that we want to do is to break down walls and those sorts of things but we just wanted to do like a quick um, makeover for how the kitchen looks and keep the structure as it is right so i'm gonna roll it out enjoy
facelift than a renovation um, so we went with um, this white vinyl wrap and these um, I might have mentioned in a vlog before that I was going for a more minimalistic look so we went for these concealed gold handles we got these from Gelma and then for the shelves we um, went with these half moon shaped uh, handles that I love very much uh, so yeah guys please let me know in the comment section whether you loved this facelift um, what you think about how much we spent on it uh, I'll actually have you know that we once got a um, quotation for 50,000 rand for pretty much the same amount of work which is vinyl wrapping changing the handles changing the countertop changing the tap or the mixer that we have as well as a um, sink literally so if this can teach you anything it is that never go for the first coat that you get because there's really no not much difference between um what the first guys that quoted us 50,000 rand were going to do and what these guys did although this time we used two different people um the guys who did um the vinyl wrapping were different from the guys who did the countertops and the cost came to just under 20,000 rand and i kid you not so and the work was pretty much the same um with very very minimal um differences so yeah if you're a regular folk you don't know how much these things go for get many codes get different codes compare codes don't go with the first code that you get right uh, so yeah that's 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 our kitchen the only thing that's left is my floating shelves so we're gonna put some floating shelves um on the side on the side of the wall just to extend the kitchen space the cupboard space the cupboards are not that full actually so they are fine but i just want to have a display here with uh, floating shelves because they're also the end thing going on <laughs> so that's the only thing that's left and that shouldn't be very expensive so we will still keep to budget um so yeah that's the only thing left guys let me know what you think in the comment section this is the end of the renovation video um and if you want to know anything please do let me know um yeah and please subscribe please subscribe what are you waiting for guys i'll see you in the next video or vlog whatever it will be bye